Hello and welcome everybody to another episode of Hunting with Pratsy single player and did you even see me? <laughs> Here we go. Uh, we have quite a lot of new stuff to cover in this episode and um, starting off with the new um, ghillie suit that I'm wearing right now and I think this is just amazing. Just look at the amount of detail. This was a competition um, and the design is made by a community member and this is just great. I mean how the developers include the community and this is what turned out to be the first community outfit of the hunter and um, I must say it's absolutely amazing. So today brand new update new species loggers point uh, cottontail rabbit. Um, along with the rabbit um, which is actually the first small game animal in, in, in the hunter just amazing awesome taking it to the next level, next step, more depth, more um, variety. Uh, it's just amazing. I mean, we can now do excessive bird hunting, deer hunting, we can do, we can hunt bears, and now even rabbits. I mean, this is just, it's getting better and better. Um, along with the rabbit update, of course, we had a, a weapon that would fit very well and that's a 22k air rifle just look at this beauty and um, yeah that's the first air rifle of the game and I must say brilliant move by the developers this will attract uh, a lot of new people I guess even because um, I think there's quite a few air rifle uh, f fans out there who are just waiting until they can hunt with an air rifle in this game and I don't think there's so many hunting games offering air rifle hunting so this is just brilliant and um, to go a little bit in detail um, I'm gonna show it to you in the inventory uh, here we go. It's a 22 air rifle. Um, it's a handcrafted 22 caliber air rifle. Perfect tool for silent precision shots. And it's um, yeah rabbits and pheasants, which you both can find here on Lagos Point. One thing I need to uh, tell you guys: um, download this game for free, start the demo. And start hunting rabbits right now because um, with the update you are actually free to hunt rabbits uh, for I don't know for how long but right now you can actually go hunting rabbits so um, check out the date where I posted this video because later this might not be true anymore but right now you can uh, just buy the demo and check it out of course you will not have this rifle but you can also shoot rabbits with a, with a shotgun. Now, um, yeah this air rifle beautifully designed and um, yeah I'm, I haven't tried it yet so I'm very curious about the performance. We just saw it's a 50 um, meters effective range so that's something we have to keep in mind of course we're using 22 air rifle pellets and um, yeah ah, this is so new it's amazing <laughs> also we have a scope with it um, 3 to 9 by 32 millimeter air rifle scope and um, it has a mill dot reticle which I'm gonna show you in a second and yeah it's very precise and we are going to take the air rifle to test actually on the range uh, right now so uh, we will check out this mill dot 
the system a bit. I haven't tried it before. This is just I just stepped in right away. So yeah, let's uh, let's see. First of all, how it looks in my hands. I might turn around so you have the lighting better. Um, looks awesome, of course, because of the ghillie suit. This textures do actually go through a little bit, but that's just a minor thing. Um, yeah, it's just a beautiful wooden stock. I like. Now let's uh, let's look through the scope first. Uh, here you can see very precise mill dot scope. Um, red crosshairs. So um, yeah, this is pretty much how I would wish it to be. And um, we we will check it out on the range later. Now let's take off the scope and see what it looks on iron sights. Here we go. Yeah, pretty much normal. Easy to figure out. There's a bit of wobbling going on here, but um, I think that's not too bad. Let's um, let's do a reloading in this position. Oh, nice. Very nice. Looks very neat. Very clean. And yeah. But let's take the scope back. And um, yeah, see you at the shooting range. Okay guys, so as you can see we are now at the shooting range and let's just try out how it um how this um air rifle is going to perform we start at 20 okay perfect 30 yeah precise 40 Still precise. 50, which is the max range actually. Okay, there you have a tiny little bit of drop down, I, th I guess. Let's try one more time. Let's aim like here. Okay, now that was that was better. So, um, yeah, I don't know. Let's do the f 75. Whoa. Okay, maybe the first mill dot. Yes, yeah, still lower. So in between the first and the second, there's yeah, something around there. Um, must say, not very logical to me. You can see I took a little, a uh, few shots before, and um. I must say, I haven't totally figured out how how I'm supposed to use this mill dot system. Maybe you guys know better. Um, all I can say is um, it looks cool. Um, the range 250 is pretty much crosshair, so that's probably also not terribly um, realistic because uh, at 20 meters you should actually probably or 30 meters you should actually aim a little bit lower because the because the pellet would take a flight line of the pellet would be first rising up and then dropping down I'm not sure but um, you guys probably know better than I so you will tell me and yeah I think the 100s is somewhere between the first dot and the next uh, thing. Well, as I said, I'm not a pro when it comes to all these things. And um, yeah, so that was it 
from my side from the shooting range and um, I'm sure you're gonna comment on it below and um, we might have a discussion about this going on so um, now of course we are going to head um, uh, into the field trying to find some rabbits and I think we are going to check out mostly this area here um, and maybe also somewhere here I think these these are the open parts or the areas where where the rabbits should be so um, let's not waste any time and um, I'll see you in the field when something happens Okay guys, we are not far from uh, the lodge and I have already found some cottontail rabbit um, tracks. So um, this is quite promising, so there should be rabbits here in the area. Um, I haven't seen any yet and um, I only n read about their behavior in the in the status update, um, which you can find at the f official the hunter forums. Um, the, by the way, uh, the greatest um, tool to stay updated what's going on um, with this game. Um, so there it was stated that. The rabbits do not make any sounds that you can pick up with the hunter mate, so uh, it's really you have to spot them, and um, it's it's of course hard to spot them as you can see in this high grass. So um, they wrote it's harder, uh, or, or you most likely will see one running off first. <laughs> before you actually see him but their behavior is um, pretty much like if they get spooked or if they get um, if they run away from you they will find a place somewhere where they can hide um, high grass or a bush or something like that and if you manage to, to, uh, to see or to actually see where the rabbit went to uh, then you have a chance to either take him out with an air rifle or a bow um, by knowing where he is and finding a spot from where you can actually get a shot off or of course you could just wait until he starts roaming again um, and also you could flush him um, and take him with a shotgun. So there is a quite a few st strategies or um, ways, hunting styles that you can do. Of course, also for multiplayer, um, you could have your buddy um, f like flushing the rabbit from the opposite um, direction towards you, and then take it with a shotgun <laughs> so um, I can see a lot of fun uh, lined up and I'm still looking for my first ever rabbit and um, this is what I love so much about new additions in this game once you... F there's another trail once you um, once there's something new, um, you look at the environment again in a in a completely new way. <laughs> so this is always very exciting, and I think we sh seem to be at the right spot. I do not know about their feeding times and things like that. So I hope we did not choose the wrong time. So it's in the evening, um, but. I have seen quite a lot of air rifle hunting real life videos um, on YouTube and it, I, I think it was most of the time either in the very early mornings or and most 
as I said, most mostly in the evenings. That's where they come out on the fields to feed. And um, yeah, it's it's about keeping your eyes open. Of course, I also took with me the rangefinder to to see if I'm within the 50 meters because I do want to make clean shots and also something that I learned from from real life videos is that air rifle hunting for rabbits is um, it's, it's actually aiming for headshots most of the time so I think that's is that's something that I'm, I'm going to do too and uh, see how it's how it's working out how the game is uh, how it's designed in the game is it as lethal as in real life is it promoted or not so we will find out about that and before this is getting too long the search for a rabbit of course I was hoping that I would find a rabbit now while talking to you guys but I figure it's it's still a little bit more difficult than I thought it would be to find one seems to be quite elusive and um, I'm actually also looking for movement as well so um, also put on scent eliminator wearing the ghillie suit Camouflage to the max. Oh, there's another rabbit. Track. What what kind of track is this? Also rabbit. We are at the right place, of course. Um, so there's nothing wrong with the area we are in. We still have to find one. Oh, the first droppings of a rabbit. All is roaming, that's still a good sign. So... I need to keep my eyes open. And I'm looking actually for movement. Because I think rabbits, they do not sit still all too long, do they? Question is of course, are they more in the thick stuff or more out in the field. I would say, or I would guess, it's easier to find them on the field or that's where they go to feed. But I cannot be sure of course. Let's take a peek. think or I guess they might be pretty spooky as well I also don't know if it might be worth um, just sitting somewhere oh, oh, what's that oh just a medium uh, dough just by the way um, speaking of the free demo version or the free version mule deer are always free for for the demo players, for the free members. So this game is really something that you can try out before you decide to decide to buy it or not, which is really good. Okay, guys. So um, I guess I have to I have to keep searching for the rabbits. There is something trotting. Again, the mule deer doe. This is pretty exciting, to be honest. And um, I, of course, will be back as soon as I find my first rabbit. Hey guys, I just saw a glimpse of a rabbit right behind that doe. I was. A I was just watching this doe and right behind that little slope there I saw something running and I'm very sure that was a rabbit 
although I only saw saw it a split second. Let's wait. If we see, there, can you see it? Okay, guys, this is very far away. Well, let's try to sneak up a bit. Okay, this is quite exciting. So it was very worthy to walk around slowly, always trying to get somewhere up on those little hills and and looking for movement. So there it is. Can you see it? Oh, how small is that? Let's check out the range. It's still way too far, I guess. Yeah, that's that's 100 meters. So let's let's just sneak up there. There it is. Still too far away. See how much they move around? There, you can see the ears only. <laughs> so I think I'm I'm, I'm gonna try to circle a little bit there. I hope you don't mind um, staying with me while we take this stock. Because this is actually... this is actually playing the game. Um, first rabbit, first strategy. <laughs> So let me see how, how close I can get before spooking it or anything. And let's always check. If we see it. Thing is it's moving around so much that I cannot be sure where it's going to pop out the next time. So stalking these is quite a challenge, I guess. That's why I keep my caution. So the plan is to to go up there to this tree and watch from this from this rock and just wait until we get a good shot. I hope I wasn't too close now. I uh, hope it didn't spook or anything. But if we can't find any... If we don't see it anymore, we can still check out um, the tracks there and see if, if one is fleeing. Then at least... Oh, there it is. There it is. Let's just watch it for a while. Let me go on this one. Oh, perfect spot. This is what it is about. <laughs> oh, now he's moving again. I hope he's going to come back in our direction. Yep. Looking good. Oh, I spotted it. Oh, please come back. I have to also um, range it, of course. Oh, that's perfect within range. Very good. 
something about 40 meters. Now we just have to wait until it comes back in the open field. Hope it won't disappear. But the good thing is we didn't spook it at all. Come on. Show up again. You guys might say now, nah, he waited too long. <laughs> I just wanted to watch it. Just picture me with my head leaning to the right right now. <laughs> As if I could like... <laughs> Uh, as if I could look around the thing there. Let's sit that one out a little bit. So from what I saw now, I must say, um, looks pretty nice. Smooth um, movements. And very tiny, very small. It's taking a bit too long now. no idea how far they are roaming or if they stay always in the same area. I think we have to continue stalking, unfortunately, since um, the rabbit seems to travel <laughs> and not stay around all the time in the same spot. See, this is just learning, learning how how to hunt those the best way. Here's lots of tracks, so I'm assuming it's even going to be the tracks of the rabbit. So he might have come up here. There he is. There he was. Okay, eight minutes left. We good there. the tracks of that rabbit. So let's sneak over the top of this thing here. <laughs> this is actually... I hear it. This is crazy. Do 
just in case. There he is. He's enjoying himself. Has no idea we're here. But I want to take the shot um, when we can. Oh s no, <laughs> that was not the plan. I wanted to see the range. Okay, that's pretty much on the edge. Okay, 50. Why not? Let's do it. Why not have a tricky shot to begin with? We missed him. Now he's cautious. Oh yeah, nice headshot. Whew. Woo! Was, that was something. What a stalk. Okay, um, 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 I think since he's so small, I'm gonna. Okay, because I want to uh, level, of course. Hopping. Oh, well. Roaming. All right. I don't know about you, but for me this was just very, very exciting. And actually, pretty much exactly how I would, um, yeah, how I expected it or how I wish it, wished it to be like. And when we took that headshot, I think even he, he had a little, he made a little jump or something. Uh, very r realistic, actually. Uh, here we have it. Score 1232, and we get a trophy integrity of 99.1, and we have a headshot. It's a male. <laughs> nice! And of course, an instant kill. Let's have a trophy shot. Achievement unlocked. First cottontail rabbit. Of course. Of course, dude. Oh, of course, now it starts to rain. Just by the way, I'm very happy about how this is going right now. Because, um,. I really want to pick up my old style of hunting, doing a little bit more uh, single player again, um, you know, being all, oh, <laughs> see, pretty terrible headshot there. Let's take the picture like, I don't know. Let's take it like this. Yeah, why not? <laughs> oh man, our first rabbit. And we took it nice and clean. Um, first shot was not too good. <laughs> but uh, right at the edge of the range that is possible. Brilliant. So I keep looking around 
for rabbits and um, hope to bag some more of those little fellas. <laughs> See you in a bit. Thank <laughs> you.